Hey guys, Danielle here with GLI's educational series, If I Can Do It, So Can You. And today I'm poolside with Mike Schrag, one of our GLI sales representatives. And today he's going to teach us how to measure a radius corner. Let's dive in. Okay, we have a radius corner here. So by radius, I mean any type of rounded corner is a radius corner. So there are six inch radius corners. There are one foot radius corners. There are two foot radius corners four foot, four and a half foot, and more. So it's very important you measure and not just try and eyeball it. Many mistakes are made when people typically just eyeball the corner and write down what they think it is. So we're showing you now how to properly measure a radius corner. What I have here are two steel tape measures that are butted up with the dummy ends of the tapes to make our imaginary 90. Then I extend both tapes down the side wall and the back wall in line with both walls. Then I come down around the corner and where the radius stops and the straight wall starts, that's my number. So here, as I come around, right here where this coping clip is, it's four feet. So that's my number on this corner, four feet. If I want to double check, all I have to do is go over to this side. Radius comes around, straight wall starts right here, four feet. So I have confirmed that this is a four foot radius corner. Now, don't make a mistake and do what some people do. They measure out to where the coping clip is. And not always is that correct because the coping clip might be in the wrong spot. Typically it is though, it's in the correct spot, but don't go by the coping clip, go by the tape measure. Where the radius stops and the straight wall starts, that is your number. So Danielle's gonna now do another corner for us, right? All right, guys, so I've already laid out my first tape measure. Now I'm gonna lay out my second one until the dummy ends meet, going right along the pool coping. Okay, I'm gonna lock it off, make sure they meet. Okay, so now I got my imaginary corner and the radius. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna look. I'm gonna make sure this is lined up right against the wall. And I'm gonna look where the corner ends and the straight wall starts. And we are right at four feet on this one. I'm gonna ignore this clip because this clip doesn't matter. You wanna go off your measuring tape. Let's look at the other side. Okay. And over here, I also have four feet. Awesome. So Mike, do I have to measure all the corners on my pool? Good question, Danielle. Yes, measuring all the corners of the pool is essential because you can't have different radius corners. So always measure all of your corners, not just one. Okay, so now I know how to measure a radius corner. You know how to measure a radius corner. Take the time, get the measurements, send it in. Good luck. 